I might have just disproved my own theory. F Attacking Terminus. Let's talk. For those of you who might have missed yesterday's video, click somewhere around this vicinity. Watch it come right back. But we are going to recap it super fast, so let's go. Everyone reunites in the train car. They make weapons, but they get gassed. Abe doesn't see it coming. They are dragged into the torture chamber for the real first introduction. Gareth makes a joke. Rick doesn't laugh. Gareth goes back to his homework. Skinhead plays Asian T-ball. Gareth stops him and sends him to the corner to mutilate a body. Bob says we all have AIDS, and they are back in the train car. This time, Rick says fucking and not screwing, and shit gets real. Somehow, Carol makes contact, maybe through the fence, and she brings in walkers. Tyrese babysits. Carol lets the dead in. Terminites realize Bob is lying about AIDS, and they go back for them. The termites open up the train car, and the gang, ready this time, kills them. Takes their weapons, aims, shoots, and hits something that explodes. And then, a bloody escape. And now, we are safely in the woods. Some of that might not even be true. Now that they escape Terminus, I fully believe that they go back for their guns. In the season 4 finale, Rick hides their guns in a duffel bag, including his python. Our gang escapes and they go back to the duffel bag and they dig it up. Now that one scene in the trailer that I believed was Rick kneeling down at the site where he buried the guns and he says, it's not over till they're all dead. Oh, what else did he say? They don't get to live. Something like that. Now, if we look close at AMC's picture right here, we could see the bag of guns on the ground. It looks partially dug up. I mean, it's barely there. It's difficult to see. The next picture will show it clearer, but it's there. You have Daryl standing over Rick, which gives it that point of view vision for the trailer. In the trailer, the point of view of the camera looks like someone looking down on Rick. It's like they're talking to each other. Daryl in this picture seems like he might be the person that Rick is talking to. All right, something important to note here. Daryl clearly doesn't have his crossbow back. Don't forget, Daryl and Michonne left their weapons, the crossbow and the sword, in Terminus. They just dug up the guns, and you can still see the guns in the ground. Rick didn't even pull out his pistol yet. In the picture, we can see from the left, Tara, Sasha, Bob, Eugene, Glenn, Maggie, Abraham, Rick, Carl. And behind Carl is Michonne. You can barely see her. Daryl goes running off, and I thought maybe he saw Carol and Tyrese, or just Carol. Maybe she broke away from leading the walkers, and she met up with them. Now, these next two pictures... It's a very subtle look that Rick and Carl share, and it's difficult to show you this look in just two pictures, but if you watch the video, it's like this. Rick has a I can't believe it kind of look, or maybe like a surprised look, somewhat r relieved look on his face, and they're looking in the direction of where Daryl went running off to. So part of me believes that this is Carol, or this might just be the reunion between Rick, Carl, and baby Judith in the woods when they get the guns. I might be reading into this a little too much, but I'm going to run with this as my prediction. The reason I believe they attack Terminus once they leave is we see them with guns at Terminus. So they have to escape Terminus, get the guns, go to Terminus, get even more guns. I believe they get even more guns anyhow. These walkers in the alleyway. The Terminus people come and kill these walkers. In the trailer you can see Rick coming up from behind the Terminus people who are gunning down these walkers and Rick guns them down. Now I believe this is a picture of Maggie attacking Terminus as well. And if you saw before, they didn't have guns. Now we see Maggie in Terminus with a gun. There's bullet hole through this window here. It might be a little war, mini war going on. This is Tara with her. And it's real difficult to see, but in a split second, you see Tara has the Uzi that Rick got off the Marauders. He uh, struggles with a Marauder in the bathroom. The Roamers, or the Claimers, they're called, the uh, Joes group. So we see Tara with the Uzi, we see Maggie in the tank top, and if you look at her shirt tied around her, she's wearing the same thing, the same belt buckle with the X's on it, the tank top with the shirt tied around her waist. I believe that this is actually a picture of her coming back to Terminus and helping hunt down the hunters. This, I believe, is Maggie in one of the houses going after the termites. Once they execute as many of the termites as possible, some of them go on a supply run or some of them go out to do the recruiting, hanging up signs, 
you know, shit like that. And Gareth might be one of those people who go out, return, and see it destroyed. Or some of them flee when Rick and them attack Terminus. We see them on the train tracks here. Rick looks like he's kneeling down, picking something up. It has to be something to deface the Terminus sign. Look at Abraham. He has the bag of guns slung over his shoulder. And we see Rick write something on the Terminus sign, it looks like. Oh, I thought he tore it down at first, but he could be scribbling something on the Terminus sign. I don't know what he would find on the ground. Some kind of rock or coal, I don't know. Dirt, mud, I don't know. It could be blood from a walker. But here is where we get an interesting picture. The gang is all here, and they're fully loaded. I mean, more than what Rick had in the duffel bag. In this next picture, we see Michonne has Carol's gun. The gun we see her with at nighttime with uh, Daryl and Carol, this is the gun that Michonne is holding. So somewhere along the lines, Michonne and Carol switch off with that gun. And Abraham, if you look, he still has that bag slung over his shoulder. Now here's a picture of Michonne with, uh, it looks like her scabbard weapon, the sheath wrapped around her chest, and she's holding the machine gun. Even after the attack on Terminus, I believe they are still actively hunting the remaining termites. And this is what leads them to Father Gabriel. And remember, the tagline for this season is hunt or be hunted. Whether or not they break out of Terminus, get the guns, and attack Terminus, or they break out of Terminus and attack Terminus at the same time and go get their guns and then hunt the fleeing termites, I believe from the gate that's what leads them to the church for sanctuary. That's my video. I would love to hear your comments on that. And the next video will go somewhere right here. I will make that click through annotation the moment the video is ready. Up here, I'm going to put the previous video, which was escaping Terminus. Uh, right here, I'm going to pop the IGN, the seven comic book moments you want to see in the TV show. I'm also on Facebook down here. We have a Twitter down here, at Ronnie Hayes. All right, guys, I'm done talking. It's your turn.